One of the largest retailers in the country is set to relocate and upgrade its store in the Marble City. Rutland Bureau Chief Connor Olathorne is live outside Walmart in the city's downtown. Connor, what can you tell us? Yeah, good afternoon, Catherine. The proposed site for the Supercenter that Walmart is planning on building isn't too far away from its current location just behind me in downtown Rutland. However, that would be past Rutland city limits and at the site of the old Diamond Run Mall. I spoke with Southern Vermont locals to get their reaction on the proposed relocation. Mostly I make the trip either to Walmart or to like Michael's or Price Chopper or something that I, I know I need. And then, you know, if I'm, if I'm here, I'll be like, hmm, do I need to do this? Do I need to do that? Dorset native Rebecca Kells makes the drive north up Route 7, heading for shopping centers miles away from home. She doesn't think that that will change if one of the stores is now moving away. Would you still consider going to that Walmart? Yes, definitely. I like, I like coming to Walmart. A lot of the time I'll just, I just need one certain thing and I'll just come here and be like, I know I need that thing, but then I'll walk around some. Walmart submitted plans to the town of Rutland Select Board earlier this week to relocate its existing store in downtown Rutland City to where the former and now boarded up Diamond Run Mall currently sits. <laughs> The original Walmart opened in the plaza in the 90s, pushing out a Kmart that went to the Diamond Run location as well. Now in a few years, a supersized Walmart is headed there too. That could leave a retail vacancy downtown. And the initiative was to draw people to our downtown um, to come spend time in the space. So with Walmart gone, we'll see less activity there. I think it's our job at the city and with the property owner to find a replacement tenant that fits the space and fits the needs of our community now. According to Walmart's Director of Government Affairs, Chris Buchanan, the new site will create at least 100 jobs and generate more with a few years of construction ahead. In the meantime, Rutland City officials say they will be busy looking for the right vendor to fill the soon-to-be vacant spot. Walmart's a big retailer and they sell a lot, but they, they are one of many that are out there that we could absolutely capture and bring to the city. Now, Walmart says their new super center is set to open in over in Rutland Town in 2027. The next step for the retail chain, however, is to go through the state's Act 250 process to begin before construction of their new super center. Portland Live in Rutland, Connor Olathorne, Channel 3 News. Thanks, Connor.